So hello guys, now the lollipop update has been officially released for Zenfone 4, 5 and 6. So here is a quick look at the ASUS Zenfone 5 lollipop update. So as you can see I am using a Zenfone 5 for this video. Okay, and this is the Zenfone 5 A501CG which sports a 1.2 GHz dual core processor and 2 GB of RAM. So I updated my the phone to lollipop. Okay, so we'll just head over to settings. The OTA is coming out in batches. However, you can directly download the zip file, which is about 700 MB in size. The link for that will be down below. And as you can see, I have the ASUS model T00J. I'll head over to software information. As you can see, ASUS T00J WW user. So I am a I am on WW framework firmware and not the TW firmware, which was required for the Lollipop beta. Okay, and you have the firmware version of 3.2, 3.40.52. Okay, so that is Android 5.0 Lollipop and not 5.1. Okay, as you can see, there is a Lollipop Easter egg holding that would bring you to the Flappy Birds game of the Android Lollipop. So, okay, so we'll head back and head over to the main screen. So, the first three things that we'll be talking about is the three issues that were there in the Lollipop beta ROM and the video for that is also on my channel the link for which will be down below go through that from okay it had three different uh, three issues mainly first was with the sound second with the proximity sensor and the third with the huge battery drain all the three issues i found were solved in this update okay so i have been using this for the last around 20 to 18 to 20 hours and as you can see the battery life is quite good okay the proximity sensor issue is solved you know the phone app launches pretty quickly and we can call and stuff okay the proximity sensor issue is solved the volume is pretty loud right now I guess you know the, like it was originally with the KitKat ROM it's not as low okay so let's play up something as you can see a lot of Bengali songs so uh, Let's find something nice, okay. That and so you heard the notification sound, there it's again, and also the music volume as you can see. It's loud enough like it was with the original Zenfone. Okay. It was very low in the beta firmware and it's fixed right now. So that is there. There is a few changes with the ASUS UI apps as you can see there is some change. Okay. And the messaging app changed a bit too, you know, the color scheme and you know this part is now white. So most Zen UIs changed as you can see. That's the notification bar. Okay. okay let's not see that. Okay, you can pull down for the notification shade or the quick action toggles. Okay, if we head over to the recent tabs, that's the recent tabs drawer. Okay, I still don't know how to root this, but hopefully a method will come out soon. And when it does, I'll make a video on how to root the Lollipop firmware, which should be available pretty soon. So it's very stable, very smooth. Okay, there are little to no bugs at all the little bugs that i would be is in the music player which is i get an app like bug i guess so if i go to edit info and i clear on clear garbage text okay the app crashes so that is i guess an app based bug and not a rom based bug okay the phone app still takes some time to launch up which is you know pretty annoying because you know it's a basic functionality and it's very important so leaving all of that asus did a very well job with this update okay it's bug free and it has 5.0 update so i hope it did solve the memory leak and the battery drain problem i will test that for around two to three days and make another video after that on the battery issue so there is still that uh, the quick bubble notification is mostly hidden i hope i wish asus updated us to 5.1 because it's much better with a lot of fixes i hope asus will forward us that update someday so 
thank you guys for watching this review okay if you haven't updated it yet either wait for the ota upgrade which will be coming or download the 700 mb file from the link down below so put the thumbs up on this video if you like this video review and subscribe me for more videos in zenfone 5 and on windows phones